Yeah, we basically grow organic vegetables here in Hungary, uh, and we uh, we have a small kind of mixed farm, but the economic activity is vegetable production. We've been doing this for many years um, in different hats or different guises for about 20, over 20 years now. Uh, and um, yeah, we're seeing a gradual kind of strengthening of, of what we're doing. We had quite a clear impact from, from when the virus kind of kicked in and or at least you know the the reactions to the virus kicked in um what we found was that there was a little bit of panic around food um and i think people a lot of people turned to the internet to look to uh what possibilities there were so we found a quite a sudden increase in demand for our boxes which from a kind of our own you know, point of view was it was nice to have that you know growth of, of, of numbers in boxes and interest, but it also put some pressure on us to adapt our system, our ordering system, our collection points and things. So there were a couple of weeks where things were a bit chaotic. Maybe there's some more, you know, some growth in interest in local food, hopefully. I would like to think that, you know, it's given people a chance to recognize some of the benefits of, of kind of doing things close to home. Um, uh, and reducing some of our impacts on the environment uh, and maybe, you know, taking more care of kind of close social connections. Um, I'm not sure if I'm <laughs> how confident I am that, that there will be many lasting effects like that, um, uh, but that would be nice. Yeah, so I haven't talked yet about our connection with, with um, um, so we have quite a long, uh, deep connection with Karganomia. Uh, we Our own philosophy on the farm is that we want to kind of build strong connections between the city and the countryside. Uh, for, for, as a countryside grower, um, and uh, uh, Karganomia sort of sees things in a similar way from the urban perspective. So we're really happy to have that partnership. We've been, for a few years now, we've been working together on using cargo bikes for delivering some of our vegetables to people who want home deliveries. And that, that has actually increased. That's been a very positive uh, direct uh, effect of the uh, COVID virus um, that uh, we're seeing more people ordering home deliveries and using the, the cargo bike service. We really, you know, subscribe to a lot of the same principles and, and kind of goals and objectives of Karganomia. We share a lot of common, you know, ideals. Um, you know, a situation like this, COVID-19, creates uh, a kind of, a, yeah, kind of a testing ground for for what happens when you know the the food systems under pressure or or you know a lot of different. Um, social systems are under a lot of pressure and people quite clearly you know initially panic about food <laughs> so having you know resilient sustainable local organic uh, seasonal systems uh, set up and in place is a very resilient solution uh, it works at a small scale it's difficult to work at a higher level I think um, uh, but because we have very you know, direct and very personal connections, then I think that system is quite, quite, quite resilient in itself.